Steve the Mac Guy here and in this video I'm going to show you how to use Siri to find the owner of a lost iPhone or iPad and how to make sure your device is set up so this will actually work. This is a video you're going to want to share with all your friends, family, and coworkers because they're the ones most likely to find your phone if you lose it and you'll want them to know how this trick works. So if you find a lost iPhone all you have to do is activate Siri and ask Who does this iPhone belong to? I believe this iPhone belongs to Steve the Mac guy. Pretty cool, right? I have lost iPhones brought to my office on a regular basis, and a majority of the time this works. Every now and then, it doesn't because the contact information hasn't been set up properly on the phone. So let me show you how to do that. First click on Settings, then go to Mail, Contacts, and Calendars. From there, scroll down to the area where it says Contacts, and make sure next to My Info it has your name and that goes to your contact information. If not, click My Info and select your contact, or create a new one. Now there's one more thing you need to check to make sure this will work. In Settings, go to Touch ID and Passcode, then scroll down to where it says Allow Access When Locked and make sure that Siri is enabled. Otherwise, when someone finds your iPhone or iPad and tries this trick, they won't be able to activate Siri. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please take a second to give it a thumbs up. If you found it helpful, feel free to share it, and don't forget to subscribe for more Mac and iOS tips.